I'm excited to take on the new role of Deputy Editor of ACS Applied Polymer Materials because I think it's going to be a great venue to showcase the intersection of science and engineering and polymers with application. My broad research area is polymers with specialties in polymers for energy storage, polyelectrolytes, conjugated polymers. If I wasn't in this field, I think I would be studying the immune system. I think it's kind of nature's biggest mystery and it's the source of a lot of human suffering and I think that science, the level of science right now is ready to address that. Authors considering ACS applied polymer materials should be thinking about preparing a manuscript that describes how their work fits into an application and how the polymer is enabling the application. And then in the manuscript, it should be clearly communicated um, what scientific method was taken and what the major findings are. What I'm looking for in a paper is essentially the take-home message. What was the major finding of the work? What problem was that investigation trying to uh, study and also what is that research question that we're getting at. Maybe you don't answer the entire research question, maybe you answer a small angle of that, but all of this should be communicated very clearly. What is the research question? How did you investigate that? And what was the major finding? And then finally stepping back and thinking about how does this change the view or alter the view of the future course of research. There are many people in my life who have inspired me and continue to inspire me. The number one person who inspires me is my sister and she was the one that chose chemical engineering and got a PhD in chemical engineering and I saw what she did and I thought I could do it as well. My mother is a retired chemist and my father did physics and they went on to do uh, quality engineering, so science was always in our home. My advice to young chemists is to stay curious because curiosity is what drives you and it brings you enjoyment. Chemistry undergrads should be prepared to work hard, but they should also know they're gonna have a lot of fun. That time of your life when you're studying chemistry or chemical engineering is going to be some of the best years of your life. And it's also a great time to make good friendships and collaborations with people that you will carry on the rest of your life.